Hello everyone and welcome to the Platinum University instructional series for Cyclebar Audiovisual Systems. In this episode, we will be covering microphone care and maintenance. After watching this video, you should be able to do the following. Identify the important parts of your headset microphone. Properly position the headset microphone for use. Properly maintain and store your headset microphone. Your audiovisual package will come with a minimum of two headset microphones. The actual model of headset you have will be either the Fitness Audio eMic or the Shure SM31FH. Both microphones carry similar features such as the frame, the element capsule, the foam windscreen, the cable, and then finally the connectors. Proper positioning of the microphone element is key to capturing clear and discernible sound and will help to eliminate popping and plosives in the sound system. The element should sit about 13 millimeters or half an inch from the speaker's mouth. Do not set the element directly in front of or too far away from the speaker's mouth. Proper positioning should put the element just at the corner of the mouth with the frame worn over the left ear. Your headset microphone is an important as well as expensive purchase and is your best tool when it comes to being an effective teacher and instructor. Regular cleaning is required not only to get the best performance and longevity out of your microphone, but for hygienic purposes as well. Protect the element and capsule assembly at all cost. Damage to the capsule, no matter how small it may seem, will affect the sound quality and or usability of the microphone. The element can be ruined by cleaning or wiping with alcohol-based sanitizers or harsh chemicals and cleaners as it will degrade any sweat-proofing or waterproofing protectants and or membranes used on the element and will prevent proper functionality. The microphone cable on your headset is very delicate and can be damaged easily. Damage to the wire can occur by compromising the external jacket either by cutting, scraping, or cleaning with an alcohol-based solvent or cleaner. You can also damage the cable by putting sharp kinks in it. Once the jacket has been compromised, the bare wires inside may touch and cause a short. Do not wind your headset wire around either the headset or belt pack as it will kink the wire and shorten the life of your microphone. The connector, or the end that plugs into the body pack, is very important and should always be kept clean. The connector can corrode to the transmitter pack if not regularly cleaned with deoxid or another oxidizer type of cleaner. In a heavy use environment, clean the connector at least once a month. Clean the connector quarterly under lighter use conditions. The connector can only be inserted in one direction. Please take note of the connector guide on top of the connector. When removing the connector from the belt pack, push here on the release button before pulling the connector. The windscreen needs to be cleaned and changed out on a regular basis for both performance and hygienic reasons. The windscreen helps the microphone to perform better by allowing the user to have the element closer to the user's mouth. This takes advantage of the noise canceling features of the microphone design. Along with proper positioning, the windscreen also helps to eliminate popping and plosives. Prior to storage and cleaning, remove the foam windscreen from the element and capsule assembly. Use warm soapy water to rinse out the windscreen, then set aside to air dry. Flooding the capsule can happen with overuse and improper dry time between uses. Flooding of the capsule will also accelerate any corrosion of the element and will quickly ruin your microphone. Cleaning the element capsule assembly should be performed after each use. We recommend Gobi Labs Microphone Cleaner and Sanitizer. It is a non-alcohol based cleaner and sanitizer developed specifically for microphones. First step is to spray the cleaner onto the cloth. Never spray the cleaner or any liquid directly into the element of the microphone. Wipe down the element with a clean cloth and set it out to dry.
After you have cleaned the microphone, place the headset in a clean, dry place. We recommend that you place the headset in an airtight container filled with rice. The rice will draw out the moisture in the headset and accelerate the drying process. This concludes this episode for microphone care and maintenance. For further support, visit support.cyclebar.com.